Today on Horseland. You better do what I say. When the power goes to Bailey's head. No, 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 Alma. Like this. Alma pays the price on the back of a runaway horse in a raging storm. I'm scared. Alma! <laughs> Careful! Watch it! Move over! Be careful! I am! You bumped me! Did not! Chip! What are they doing and why? They've been doing it all morning and they keep going crash and boom and... Uh -uh. Teeny, can you and your fly sit far away? Huh? Oh, okay. No problem. Big moving! <laughs> okay! Guess they haven't got their routine down yet. Oh, oh, oh. Stupid fly! Teeny, would you mind moving to the other side of Portland? Now, Angora, she's fine where she is. You're being more bossy than usual today. Just because I know the best solution to a fly problem doesn't mean I'm bossy. It means I'm smart. Watch it, will ya? Oh, dear Shep, shouldn't those kids be getting better with all this practicing? Ooh, humans have no clue why they do what they do. Sometimes things gotta get a little tangled before folks can figure out how to untangle them. Oh! Oh! Be careful! Something tells me today is gonna be one of those times. And it was announced this morning the riders have been selected to lead tomorrow's opening parade for the county fair. It's Horseland Stables, first-timers at the fair. But word is they're all winners, a precision drill team of horses and riders that promises to wow the crowds. <laughs> Sounds like drill team practice isn't going so good. Somebody zigged when they should have zagged. Hey, how'd I get over here? Completely, utterly, totally lame. Took the word right out of my mouth. Sorry, my bad. We're going to have to do a lot better than this. Ah! Make it stop! Turn it off! Oh, brother. I'm calling break time. Me too. Look, it's okay. We've got plenty of time before the parade tomorrow. Yeah, we can do this. Not with Bailey riding lead, we can't. I heard that. You better do what I say. Oh, who falls off his horse and still gets to play lead rider? Chloe, you know the drill. When we do parades, we take turns being lead. Now it's Bailey's turn, so let's just follow his lead, okay? Thanks, Sarah. No problem. You don't have to worry about us. Keep your eye on your line. We'll follow you. Got it. No sweat. Okay, one more time. <sighs> Pinch me when Bailey gets it right, would ya? Come on, Chloe. Move it along, Zoe.
you're going. Me? You! I was watching my line. Was not. Was too! Was not. Was too! I don't know what's wrong with me. I can't seem to do any of this the way Bailey wants. I don't think this has anything to do with you, Alma. And again it ends in disaster. This is exhausting. Enjoy the show, you two. I'm taking a nap. You keep running into me. Don't talk to her that way. Don't you tell me what to do. You're not the boss of me. Today, I am. I guess I wasn't keeping my flag straight, huh? Your flag was fine, Alma. Let's take a break, riders. It's lunchtime. Oh, goody, goody, did you hear that? Lunchtime, that means leftovers. Oh, I hope no one wants the cream corn today. Hungry, small, hungry. <laughs> About time for a real break. Hey, Molly, Sarah. How's it going, Alma? Okay, I guess. Hi, Will! Chloe, Zoe. Hey, Will. Let's take five, cousin. Somebody's getting in trouble. Listen, Will, I know what you're thinking. Nobody knows what you're thinking until it comes out of your mouth. At least, that's what Grandpa used to say. Remember? Listen, about the parade, I was just trying to... Horses first. Right. Horses first. Why isn't Will chewing him out? You know Will, first take care of the horses, then he'll chew Bailey out. I was thinking about something else Grandpa used to say. When you're in charge of an outfit, listen to your riders and horses, and they'll listen to you. Come on, Jimber. Road trip. What does that have to do with me? For the rest of the day, you're in charge of this outfit. You mean, in charge of the parade practice, right? In charge of Horseland. Really? Your folks had to go on and set up for the parade. They called me to come help out. While we're gone, you're the leader of the pack, pal. Yes! Remember, your riders, your horses. Listen to them, and they'll listen to you. Oh, you know it. I won't forget. That was Will. I wonder where he's going. Beats me. Yeah, Scarlet! Hey, Sarah, where are you headed? That's what I wanted to ask you. Aren't you supposed to be in charge of the ranch when Bailey's folks are gone? Gotta go help him set up for the parade. I left Bailey in charge. You, um, think he's ready for it? Do you? I'm not sure. Me neither. Grandpa used to say, sometimes the best way to learn to do a thing right is to do it wrong first. Okay, Will. If you say so. If you think he isn't cutting it, sit him down and have a talk. Now what? What's he doing out there? Come on, everybody! Back to work! We gotta practice! <sighs> oh, brother. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where are you going? You don't have to do what Bailey says. Who does he think he is? For the rest of the day, he's the boss. Will's gone and he left Bailey in charge. <gasps> See ya. Ugh, Bailey's in charge. Alma, go left! Look out! Wait, I mean right! No, your other right! Careful! Look out! Oh, 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 not good! Everyone stop! I said cut! Oh, so now you're a big time director? Please. You know... 
it's times like this that make cats glad they're not people. Remember when I said sometimes things got to get a little tangled before folks can figure them out? Everyone, listen up! Would you quit with the orders, Bailey? I'm in charge here. I should have said a lot me. tangled. Let's stop arguing. I'm not arguing. Me either. <laughs> Give me my flag. <laughs> hey, maybe we'll win a prize for most tangled up team. <laughs> right, Bailey? Uh, uh, uh. Give me that. Uh. You saying this is my fault, Molly? Bailey, she was making a joke. Yeah, about me. What kind of leader are you? Go this way. No, go that way. Come on, Chloe, give him a chance. But his orders don't make any sense. They would if you'd listen. Bailey, they're sort of right. Hey, I'm trying the best I can. Bailey, try to listen to what we're saying. Sometimes what you want us to do isn't clear. Fine. Then I'll make it really, really clear. Every rider follows a string. Is that clear enough? He can't be serious. Our horses have to step all over that string? Bailey, I'm not sure this is the best way to... Let's go. parade tomorrow, we paint ourselves to look like zebras. Why would we do that? Do you really want 10,000 people to know who you are? She's got a point. All right, here are your new instructions. There. Simple enough? All you have to do is follow the diagram and everything will be fine. Any questions? Bailey, could we talk a minute? No. Why don't you take Button back to the stable? It's almost dinner time anyway. But what about Bailey? I need to have a serious discussion with him. All right, looks like Sarah got Alma. We can start up again. Oh, goody. Where's Alma going? I told her she and Button should take a break. You told her? It's dinner time. It's practice time. Practice is over. What do you think you're doing? We'll put me in charge, not you. We have to practice. We have to talk. I say we go on strike. It's the only way to show him who's boss. And who is boss? We are. We'll vote all in favor of going on strike until Bailey lightens up, say I. 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 Alma, you with us? <sighs> anyway, so it's three to one. We win. So who wants to tell Bailey he's not the boss anymore? Don't look at me. You're the oldest. What? That's not true. Ooh, sounds like someone's putting Bailey in his place. Listen. What do you mean I'm not listening? I am too listening. Bailey, you're not. You're not giving clear directions, and you've made Alma so nervous she can barely ride. I'm not the one messing up here. Look, 
You have to chill out or 10,000 people are going to be laughing at us tomorrow. <gasps> if we get laughed at, it'll be because you aren't paying attention. Bailey, either you get your act together or we're done. Fine then! I'm going to need help with this, Will. Sarah! Alma's gone! But it's raining outside. Where would she have gone? Alma? Alma! <gasps> Bailey? What are you doing out here? I don't know. I'm trying to figure things out. Everything's just a big tangled mess. I don't know what to do anymore. Listen, Alma's taken this harder than anyone, so there's one thing you can do. You can help me find her. Huh? Did you hear that? Sounds like Button. Alma? What's she doing out there? She's doing what you wanted. She's practicing. In this storm? She's trying hard to please you, Bailey. Alma! <laughs> <gasps> Alma! Bailey, what do we do? My folks and Will aren't back from the fairgrounds yet. Storm's probably holding them up. Come on! It's up to us now! to be sitting in the mud laughing yeah what kind of leader are you anyway what kind hmm. don't have a clue don't think I've had a real clue all day I'm just sorry for what I put you through especially you Alma that's okay Bailey so anybody got any idea what we do now yeah two things first we eat cuz I'm starving and second then we get the arena lights back on, and you show us what you want us to do tomorrow. Okay. There they are, folks. The team from Horseland Stables. Just look how they're following the first rider's lead. Now that's one fine outfit. Reminds me of what my granny used to say. When you're in charge of an outfit, listen to your riders and horses, and they'll listen to you. 
Easy to see everybody's listening to that boy. They look pretty good, don't they? Now that they've got everything straightened out. Yep, they look just wonderful. Teeny, move over so I can... Mm. Uh, I don't want to sound bossy, you know, but could you please slide over just a bit so that I can see? Oh, of course, Edgar. I'd be happy to. Thanks, Teeny. And thank you, Angora. Ha <laughs> ha 